What's the most abundant element in the universe? Hydrogen. In fact, it makes around 70% of all mass. Let's look into how it can play an important role in the future energy landscape. Hydrogen has a very high energy density. That means that one kilogram of hydrogen can carry the same amount of energy as three kilograms of gasoline and 150 kilograms of lithium ion battery. Today, hydrogen is mostly used in oil refining and fertilizer productions. However, different countries across the globe plan to adopt hydrogen as a fuel for transportation purposes or energy carrier for storage. When it comes to achieving net zero strategies, electrification proves to be the most energy and cost efficient solution in most of the cases. Yet, there are sectors where energy density is critical. This includes industrial applications such as steel production or transportation, where heavy duty, chips, airplanes are good examples. This is where hydrogen comes in as a solution for decarbonization. However, in order to be in a real zero carbon fuel, hydrogen's origin matters. Specifically, hydrogen is only a zero emission fuel if it is produced through electrolysis powered by renewable energy. This is generally called as green hydrogen. Several countries are reacting. For example, the European Hydrogen Strategy aims to install at least 6 gigawatts of renewable hydrogen electrolysis by 2024 and 40 gigawatts by 2030. As this electrolysis will represent a significant load, the proper integration into our power systems of the future will be critical. With more than 120 years of experience in grid integrations, we are looking forward to supporting the developments of green hydrogen projects all over the globe with our power consulting expertise and grid integration solutions. This is how we can contribute to sustainable energy landscape. My name is Carola Ines and I'm powering good for sustainable energy.